You take too long to set up. Love you too, sweetie. So, sweetie, we are doing our cat skills series, starting with subversive malting brewing. So we're at subversive malting brewing in not only the Catskills, but in the Catskill city of the Catskills. Yes, that is true. If I sound subdued, it's because I just drove for two hours and skipped lunch. You know what helps with that? You gotta do the thing. <laughs> no, you're gonna knock over the beer. That was wonderfully fast. This is the full Thank you. That's the slaw on the side. So then this is the beer slushy made with their forbidden fruit black currant sour ale. So you get to not only try a sour, because you always like to try a sour, but it is made into a frozen cocktail. Start Yikes. by, hmm, it's kind of sweet and sour. It's pretty good. Very good, actually. Beer slushy at Subversive Brewing in the Catskills. Well, don't chug it. Maybe I'll have another spoonful. Darn, that's a good beer slushy. Best beer ever at Subversa Brewing in the Catskills, New York. You are not on your game with jokes today. I told you five times the name of it is Forbidden Fruit. You could have made so many jokes with that and you were just like, woo, woo. Hold on, hold on. You give me way too much to remember. I'm not good at getting being off book. Forbidden Fruit Beer Slushy at Subversive Brewery in Catskills, New York, for being beer slushy. Wow, that is the most refreshing, forbidden time I've had in Sweetie. A long time. We sweetie. are on vacation. Uh, sweetie, what? can we be a little bit forbidden? Or maybe I am forbidden to you, but we are on vacation. <laughs> you ready? You ready for some beer? This is called Camp Comet. It's a New York IPA, 7% alcohol, single malt and single hop IPA featuring New York Comet hops. Mm, that's got a, a kick to it, a tangy effervescent kick. Really refreshing, really good IPA. It's delicious. It has all the good qualities of an IPA, like tangy, flavorful, fruity, without that kind of some really like, some of them just have a, too much bite. Camp Comet at Subversive Brewing in Catskills, New York. Yeah. Camp Comet. That was wonderfully refreshing, sweetie. But sweetie, I can't comment on it because I'm under non-disclosure. Okay. Wonderfully refreshing, but I can't. Ca I can't comment. Okay. I can't. I can't comment. So this one is called New York Nectar, and this is the one they said was hazy. Also super yummy. I realize that's not a real tag. Now. now it is. Yeah. That sweetie has said it on beer vlog number 47. Now it's a technical term. Even though we do a beer vlog, I'm not a big drinker. A lot of times I really like tasting an IPA, but I can't really imagine drinking a big, you know, mug of it because it's very intense, very intense. As I always say, it is the Sauvignon Blanc of beer. Tangy, flavorful, but sometimes a little too tangy and flavorful so that you wouldn't want a bunch of it. Both of these are just perfect. I could drink a pint. New York Nectar at Subversive Brewing in Catskills, New York. New York Nectar. Yum, 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 yum. That's like if you took a flower made out of beer, it would be uh, nectarlicious Maybe like this. Maybe that's why a bee was flying by here. This just puts me in New York State of Mind, which I should say I'm always in New York State of Mind because I live in New York State all my life. But this puts me in New York State of Mind times two and all nectarlicious. I can't choose between them. I started to say, oh, this one is real sparkly on the tongue, but then I tasted this one again and it was too. They're both excellent. And the best beer slushy ever. It's a verse of brewing in Catskills, New York.